What is going on YouTube? BD Kane 721. It is Wednesday afternoon. Uh, taking a break from work. I've got a couple of packages that came in the mail yesterday. Um, was I made a few purchases over the past week. I was also involved in one of Mike O's latest live sales. I think maybe it was about a week ago. I know I think he just had one last night, but I wasn't involved in that one. But the previous one I got involved with. Uh, quick little announcement. Here is my sponsor for this video. Altoids. Arctic flavor. Curiously cool mints. Got that at uh, Costco. I don't know. They had a big package of them for, I don't know, 8 or $9. And they're actually pretty good. I like them a lot. So let me just rip into... Let me rip into one of these packages. I'm not even sure which one this is. Uh, I made a, I made a connection on eBay the other day with a guy who was selling some 2019 Topps Chrome blue refractors, and he. Oh wait a minute, that's not what this is. Holy crap! Oh. Well, what do you know? Something I don't get very often, which I always appreciate, is a care package. So I'm pretty shocked and really excited, actually. So a little note. Hope you enjoy the cards, bro. Your pal, Yankees Cards. Very, very nice of you, Yankees Cards. Uh, appreciate the gesture. I'm going to open these up right now. Honestly, I'm, I'm a little bit stunned, I guess. I, I don't know what to say other than thank you. I don't get care packages very often. I'm not a, I'm not somebody that looks for them or, or needs them in any way or shape or form. Uh, but when they do show up, obviously, it's very, very nice. Sent me a bunch. looks like a bunch of Padre cards, which... If anybody knows me, knows I'm really excited about this season coming up. Oh, got a nice Fernando Tatis Jr. right on top. It's an awesome shot of him. This is a Topps card. I don't really know. Um, this must be one of the inserts, maybe, for this year. I'm assuming. I haven't opened up any Top Series 1 or any products for 2020 yet. So this is really cool. Fran Mil Reyes, who is now on the Indians, I believe. Or maybe he's not on the Indians anymore, but he was traded last year to the Indians. Another Fran Mil Reyes. My new favorite Padre, Mr. Machado. What up, Wesker Griff? You know, he showed off. He, sh he I think he showed a uh, recent Machado pickup. I think he's going to have a good year. This is Mackenzie Gore, one of their up-and-coming lefty starters. Although I think he was in trouble with the police this past offseason. Not sure what the what their result of that are yet. This is the new stud of the of the staff, Chris Paddock. Rookie card, very nice. That's awesome. Oh, that's my phone. Don't know who that is. Uh, we've got another another Tatis rookie cup from Tops. Love it. That is awesome. I think I've got this coming as well in my Myco package, which will be opened up next. So I've got ton of I've got a few of these now. That's awesome. Love it. Love that shot of him. You know, I heard rumors that they were looking at trying to trade for Francisco Lindor from the Indians, and I don't know how they would end up pulling that off with having Tatis already in the lineup. Another Machado looks like one of those insert cards. From this year's tops certainly has a bad rap i don't think it's warranted but that's just me here's a nice tatis rookie card from heritage holy crap that's awesome i don't have that one very nice that is 2019. pretty cool pretty cool stuff Another Tatis rookie card in the 84 version. Don't have that one either. Very nice. 
Again, I think this must be one of those inserts from last year. Don't really know. Obviously, you've seen my Padre PC that has started to grow a little bit over the last couple of years. That's a really cool shot. Rookie card of Tatis from Topps Gallery. That's awesome. That is so cool. He just looks like a ball player in the new in the new era, right? One of those new young hot rookies. Just looks like one of them. Very cool. Well, we got Tony Gwynn on top of this stack. So I'm assuming this will be maybe a little bit more of old school Padres. This little stack. Rest in peace, Mr. Gwynn, Mr. Padre. Oh, got a nice little Robbie Alomar. The rookie card. Right on top. From 88 Donruss. Very cool. Hall of Famer, right? Cool 1975-style Eric Hosmer. He had a good season last year, mainly because I think Machado was in the lineup, but he, he finally had a good season with us. So, Will Myers, Topps Chrome 2019, most likely will be traded before the season starts, unless they're trying to, <clears throat> if anybody wants to assume his hugely inflated salary. Jacob Nix, another one of their young prospects. I think he'll get up to the to the rotation this year potentially. Manny Margot off to the Rays, Rays or Blue Jays? I can't remember. I think it was the Rays. Good defensive outfielder for sure. There's another Margot from Optic, pink. Very cool. There's Mr. Trevor Hoffman, Hall of Famer. They just unveiled a new statue of him outside the park, what, a couple of years, a couple of seasons ago, maybe? Really cool statue of him. There's Will Myers again. Mr. Eric Hosmer, Topps Heritage. Looks young there for some reason. Hunter Renfro, off to the Rays. Have to say, I don't miss Hunter Renfro, and the season hasn't started, and I'd rather have Tommy Fan, so I think that was a good deal. That the Padres pulled off. Here's a Dave Winfield, Topps Rookie History. Mr. Hall of Famer. Uh, Cal Quantrill, another young prospect. This is from Bowman Chrome. He might be on the move too. They're talking about trading him. Here's one of those Holiday Pedro Avia rookie cards. I really like the look of these Holiday cards. Really nice. Another Cal Quantrill, Holiday, rookie. Manny Machado, Topps Gallery. Interesting photo. Pedro Villa, rookie card from Topps Gallery. Here's Luis Urias. Urias. He's on the Brewers, I think. They traded him in the offseason. Another Urias. And a 1982 Donruss. I think this is originally in the... Yeah, Ozzie Smith. Looks like it's in pretty good shape, too. Corners look sharp. Centering's just a tad bit off, but not really that bad at all. Very cool. Look how young he looks. People forget that he was with the Padres in his beginning of his career. Unfortunately, they let him go. And then we've got last two cards here. Manny Machado from National Baseball Card Day 2019. Awesome shot. And another Machado from Topps Heritage. Very cool. Thank you so much for that package. That was awesome. These guys are all going right into my Padres PC. That's going to be a fun little exercise for me to put them all into that. I've started a new little shoebox to, to collect all the Padres. And so um, there's, there's quite a bit now, quite a few players to collect. So really excited about that. Thank you, bro. Really appreciate it. I'll hit you back. Um, and I'll make sure I get something nice out to you. Let's see here. We've got Mike O. Sent me the... Let me the cards that I purchased in his live sale. Let me see if I can get this thing open. He really 
package cards up really well. For those of you who don't know Mike O, check out his channel. He's got live sales every now and again. I think he does it a couple times a month. Really great deals. Most of the stuff is low end, but sometimes he'll pull out some pretty nice cards. So I bought a couple of team sets from him. He said he had 2019 Tops Chrome, or not Tops Chrome, Tops Series 1 Padre sets. I think he had four of them. But I wanted to get the Tatis cards in there because the Tatis cards have the Rookie Cup, as you've seen in the nice care package I just received. So... Here are the cards for the Padre team sets. We've got the Manny being Manny, uh, Kirby Yates, Ian Kinsler, Andres Nuno, Munoz, Michael Baez, Matt Strom. There's the Tatis card, which now I've got a couple more of them. Manny Machado, there's Chris Paddock, Hunter Renfro, Joey Lucchese. Austin Hedges and Adrian Morayon. Morayon? I'm not sure how to pronounce his name. So there's two sets there of. Let me put the Tatis card on the front. And then I bought the Tatis 85 version. And the Machado um, from the Silver Pack. You can see the shine there. But I wanted to get this Tatis too. So now that I have that one. And I've got the Machado. And then just another pack of cards for the team set for the Padres. So that was the mail day. Again, thanks a lot, Yankees cards. I'm going to leave his link down below. Go check him out. Give him a sub. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Sorry it took so long. I wasn't expecting that care package. So thanks for staying with me, and I will talk to you guys soon. See you.